Very well, welcome back to Let's Play Golden Sun. Last time we explored the town of Biblin. And we learned of the curse of the tree. And a bunch of stuff that is happening basically. And we know what we have to do. So now, here's what we're going to do. There are two things that you can do here, actually. I pull this up. You can go over here, where Coloma Forest is, and try to take care of the curse. Or you can follow the path over here and reach the snowy region. And really, you can do whatever you want. But I think the game wants you to go to Colima Forest. Even though you cannot completely finish what's in co to do in Colima Forest yet. Man, one damage that new armor. It's really helping us. Yeah, these guys are a bit tough though. Oh, they're defending. That's why they were taking no damage. Don't need to waste synergy on you. It's fine. Can you stop? The they, they defend so much, man. Stop. There we go, one's down. I should probably use some synergy. These guys defend so much. So today, I'm going up here. Toward the lighthouse, not toward Coloma. This is for a good reason. Oh, okay. Uh, I got a first strike. You know what? Everybody use some synergy. We got Earthquake. We got Fire. We got... We got Ray. Let's go all out of synergy with these guys. Alright, Earthquake. It's all of them. Okay, and fire. Every now and then we gotta do this. We gotta use some synergy. Are we doing an elf? We're doing fine. No big deal. The reason why I'm going this way is that because we can pick up a weapon for Ivan. Uh, sure. Uh, use a ray, whatever. Because let me see something here. Um, Isaac has a big what's this? Broadsword, right? You have a lot. Sorry, long sword. A little bit, a little, a little hiccup as I said. So here's what I'm thinking. Just yeah, just ray, whatever. Wait, Gar's defending? Uh, the unit's own well, he, did, he attacked the other monster. That's right. It's fine. We're fine. Every, everybody's fine. So, where did the Biblical Cave entrance? Now, we need to do something with the Sprout. Now, in order to do that, we'll be switching Flint with Forge. Because that will give Isaac a different set of synergy and will give him growth. Garlic will also get growth, but it's okay for now. So, we're gonna switch them back. Again, I don't want to go into details now classes work just yet. Just because we have very few Dizini, so we can't really show a lot. For now, we're just going to keep all the Dizini with the characters of, their own, of the same element. So the Elven Rapier is a very good weapon. Look, it's even stronger than what Isaac has right now. 85 attack. But for once... because I've Oh wait, no, I didn't want to do that. <laughs> Sorry, for once. I've never done this. I'm giving this to Ivan. 56 attack. The reason why I want to do that is because the unleash of that weapon is Wind Elemental. And because Ivan is Wind Elemental, it should do more damage. At least generally it should do more damage. Anyway, the monsters in here are quite strong. We need to be a bit careful. Actually, there we can take a look at something. 81? Nope. 47? 56? Ivan has more attack than Garrett right now. <laughs> that is weird. That is very weird, considering usually Garrett has a lot of attack. But now we could uh, we could do this. We could have we could give this broadsword to Garrett. That could have, that could be an interesting thing to do. You know what? We'll do that. We'll give that there, and we'll give this Broadsword to Garrett, 73. Yeah, I feel like that's a bit better. And we're doing on coins, yes. Yeah, we could farm 1,000 coins right now. Just to buy another Broadsword. Could be an idea. But it won't be necessary. It's definitely something I can do. I'm 
But yeah, that elven rapier is definitely something you're not supposed to get right now. As you're meant to go through that cave a bit later. Now, before we head on to... Come on. Okay, there's a rat here. It's fine. Just one rat. I want to go rest at the town one more time. Regain all my PP. Wow, just... Okay, it's fine. You know what? Sure. Go all out with synergy, guys. Well, it doesn't seem like I'll need it. I think Isaac is leveled up. It's fine. Uh, yeah, we'll we'll rest one more time. It's only what is it? Twenty one. It's fine. These are very cheap. And that's a good thing. Reviving is not very cheap. So we have to pay attention to what we're doing. Now, let me show you something interesting. If you go, I think it's over. It's nearby. There's this. Remember that special spot where I died a few episodes ago? There's another of such spots nearby. Oh, that other one just run. Okay, fine. We'll get you then. I think it's down here. No, wait. I missed it. I go. I see it. Okay, it's over here. Uh, let me let me save first before I do some weird stuff. Yeah, we'll save. I think it's down here. Is it? No, jeez. Oh, can I can I run? I don't want to show this off. I think it's this one, right? No. No, it, and it's gotta be down here. Is it after the barricade? No, I think it's it's gotta be down here. Let's see if I can find this. Before I get completely destroyed. I just want to show this off. I think it's this where this lone tree is, right? Let me see this. Because after the barricade... I'm pretty sure it's this. No, these are just rats. It's not this spot. It's a spot here near the barricade, but I'm not quite sure where it is. Is it here? No. I thought it was this spot right here. Maybe it's after the barricade. I'll check after the barricade. I'll attack first so I get run away. Okay. Okay, once we are at the barricade... This door is locked, but you know what? We don't need to do that. We don't need to go through the door. And there are some trees here. They are so heavy. Oh yeah, it's over here, okay. This is the spot where you can fight hard enemies. We'll save over here. Okay. Yeah, here. You just old, old right. And you get death heads, uh, which are quite strong. We'll try our best. We're gonna die. <laughs> I'm just saying, we're gonna die. Ooh, 26. 38. Ooh, flint. 25 damage. Attack up. I'm gonna try to heal. See what we can do. Are they weak to Mars or... I have no idea what they're weak to. I'm just gonna summon Mars and Jupiter. Ooh, six. Oh, please don't kill Garrett. Shit. I don't even know what they're weak to. Uh, we tried. <laughs> I mean... Oop. Uh, we're still alive. I mean, Gar isn't, but... Okay. That one can kill one of us, and then the other one can probably finish it. Yeah, okay. Not worth it. Not worth it whatsoever. We're soft resetting. We're loading the safe up. But yeah, uh, that, that's something you can do, I mean, if you want. Now, over here is a little secret. Which I don't know how you can tell this is a thing. 
Because I'm pretty sure there's not a single NPC that tells you this. Or even gives you a remote hint about it. But if you go over here... And kill all the enemies in the way. Come on. Well, these guys are strong, man. And you check in the middle of this forest. You'll find turtle boots. Turtle boots are an interesting piece of equipment. What they do... If they raise your defense, but they lower your agility. Uh, can you actually see that details? Yeah. Uh, you get three points of defense, which is it's bad. Okay, but they're boots. So they don't take the place of any of your current armor. They're a separate type of armor. Uh, but they all of your agility. These are actually good for reasons that will come in a, apparent later in the game, but nobody really wants them right now. Pick them up though, you can sell them if you don't want them in your inventory, they'll just, they're an artifact. You can just buy them at any armor shop, just go under artifacts and you can buy them back. And probably I'll end up selling them because I don't need them right now. The reason why they're good is that since they halve your agility, you can make a fast character act last. And acting last might not seem interesting at first, but it is. It is, because of summons. And we'll explain what that, what that means later. As of now, there's a forest over there. You could go there. But instead, I'm going to go over to another place. Because we, go to, we, co we could go to the forest and do everything there. But we're going to go over here first. It's so quiet. What is the matter, Ivan? This tree was a person. Everyone in Colima has been turned into a tree. Why? Do you know why this happened? I mean, we got some hints at back at the village, but let's just say no. We're not 100% sure. I see. Who could have known? What is it now, Ivan? There's sparkly stuff on the ground. What is it? Ah, what's happening? My mind! Someone is stacking my... What is that? Something's falling from the sky. It's sparkling. Could this be what turned those people into? We've got to get out of here. I can't. I can't move. Isaac, what just happened to us? That barrier, did it save us? I think so too, Isaac. I think I know what those domes were. It was our synergy. What are you, crazy? I didn't use any synergy. Hey. I can stand. I can move again. Ivan, it's okay. Go ahead. Stand up. Those barriers. We thought that synergy was only used when we concentrate, right? When I was training, I focused so hard I thought my head would burst. Well, maybe it's just easier for you, but when I use synergy... 
Anyway, I'm certain that was synergy that we were projecting. That must mean that some synergy acts only when it's needed. You mean like we're in danger? I think it's like we strike really, when we strike critical hits in battle. We can control it, but it's there when we need it. I can agree with what Garrett's saying. It is definitely possible. Would it be something? If, would it be something if we could use this power at any time, Isaac? Of course. Yeah, let's start trying to master this power. Watch out! It's happening again. Room, why? Why they? Why don't they turn into trees? Who are they? What people are these who are immune to threats? Glamour. Have they come to save that village with their strange powers? It will not be enough to save the people of Kolima. They've earned their fate. Kolima took their access to me, and now I shall take mine to them. Your children may not know this, but we are dying. And Kolima Forest will wither and die when we are gone. We're not the only ones who will die, Laurel. Once we're gone, they too will go. Threat was once a kindly forest king. But he's slowly dying and his earth has torn in two. His wrathful sight turned the people of Kolima into trees. The kind threat speaks no more. Hroom, the kindly heart invites destruction. I need no kindness. If you wish to save those whom threat turned into trees, you must reawaken his gentle side. But if you cannot stop threat from withering, we all will. Look for threat deep within the forest. It's no use, Laurel. Humans cannot be trusted. I shall die, and the rest of the forest will die with me. Isaac, isn't there anything we can do? What can we do? Do you have an idea? Yes, I've played this game before. Think I don't know? Looks like Isaac has something in mind. We'll leave it up to you, Isaac. Let's go save everyone. So it's really, it isn't really clear what you can do, but um, you can head to the forest and try to check out the tree. Also, you can mind read these trees. This is called a village of lumberjacks. I think this is a reference to something, right? There is a reference to something else in the, in this town. But I don't know if that's it. Let's see, let's mind read all, the, all these trees. What the hell are you... Why can't you resist? Oh, so they're all thinking that... I mean, they're all... Someone's definitely on the right track here. So this guy's from Emil. Came all the way here to cut down trees. And he got turned into one. Now we're doing on PP. Yeah, we're good. We have a lot. So unfortunately, there's no in 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 this. There's no in in this town, and there are no shops because everyone is turned into a tree. This, okay, I think this is the the equivalent of the of the sanctum. Okay, so these are kids. If I can't move, then mom can make me go to bed. Wow, what a way to think, kid. Okay, so you're you're eating water from the ground. What about the weapon shop? Okay, he can even talk, become a tall tree. Less funny like that. Yeah, the irony. The irony. What are they staring at? They seem awfully young. They don't stand a chance against threat. I mean, we stood a chance right now. Can we? I wanted to check that plot. I drive the mighty warrior with a thick bird ended this curse. I dream about him a lot, actually. What about here? The holy tree of Kolima Forest. Threat and Laurel are the spirits of the holy trees protecting Kolima Forest. Alright. Well, we can't already guess that from what's happened, but... The art of logging. One must study trees and train one's body well before logging. 
Whoops. Anything in here? Hey, coins. Yeah, that's maybe the reason why... But yeah, you were only doing your jobs. That's kind of weird. The two sides of one thing, you know. Uh, okay. How about you? All right then. Uh, there are, I think there are a few more houses to check. And there's the Dini over there. Which we will get. In just a second. Okay, you pick you for a three, I guess. Uh, what about you? Hey. You don't want to be stuck as a tree? We'll, we'll, we'll find a way to free you. Don't worry about that. Okay. This is the last one, I think. Okay, this guy doesn't mind. Yeah. It's bad for the kids, man. Now, here's the thing. How do you get the Disney? Because you can clearly see a hole there with a ladder. So you'd be thinking, well, I just entered this out, there's a passage. And there's not. Father's secret? Huh. To your treasure? Dictionary of trees and flowers. The book describes every species of trees and flowers in Angara. Notice anything weird about this house. It is different from the others. Let me show you what I mean. So these are all three houses. You enter this one. And it's quite big. It's round. It has a round shape. Now, if you enter this one, it does not have a round shape. So if you are clever, you will find that there is an entrance on the back. And that's where the secret passage leading to the genie is. Find anything. Okay, fine. We'll just go to find the genie. Uh, there are random encounters in this uh, in this area here, so yeah. Just be ready. Like that. Spread some damage around. I should probably use Garb Synergy. It's weaker than Ivan's, but at least I'll let Ivan recover some PP while we walk around. He needs it. Yeah, we're definitely going to use Garb Synergy here. Oh, we have Flare Wall. It's a new one. Oh, they're weak to fire. Interesting. Not sure if I told you how you can tell whether something is weak to or resist an element. Anyway, we're not in, we have no random encounters in this area, so you can join right up. No need to fight you, my friend. Join my party. And this is Granite. Granite is a very useful Dizini. Well, oh, oh, okay, look at this. We're gonna set this Dizini and Isaac goes from Squire to Knight. Look at all the stats. Look at the stats he gets. That's because he gets into another class. Every class gives a boost to stats. The, higher, the better the class, the better boosts that you get. So Granite, very, very useful Dizini, as you might have seen from the info screen. It will reduce damage. In the turn that he's cast, and he always goes first, so you get always get the sweet reduction. Very useful if you need to heal up, or there's someone like if there's someone very low on HP, you just cast that, protect them, and then you heal that them that person. All useful to set up or at the beginning of a battle. It's very nice. Anyway, we're trying to get out of here now before I get completely destroyed. Okay, nice. So, now we know what to do. We have another genie on our side. We'll heal up Ivan. So next time on Let's Play Golden Sun, we'll, we'll head deep into Colma Forest. See you guys in the next video.